Hi, I'm Dr. Cindy McCloskey, Director of the Anatomic and Clinical Pathology Residency Program at the University of Oklahoma. Thank you so much for taking an interest in our program and we hope that you find some valuable information in our program video. The University of Oklahoma Health Sciences Center is a comprehensive health sciences campus including the Colleges of Medicine, Dentistry, Allied Health, Nursing, Pharmacy, and Graduate Studies. The OU Medicine Hospitals include OU Medical Center, which is an adult facility with the state's only level one trauma center, the Children's Hospital, a freestanding women and children's hospital, and OU Medicine Edmond, a smaller suburban community hospital. Our residents also benefit from the Stevenson Cancer Center. Stevenson is the state's only National Cancer Institute designated cancer center. I'm Dr. Lewis Hassel. Uh, I'm a professor of pathology and I specialize in uh, anatomic pathology. Several years ago we set out to uh, become a leader in digital pathology and in digital pathology education. Um, and we've developed a lot of tools and uh, taken a lot of steps to do that. And it's really paid off uh, here during the COVID situation to have a, a real rich resource of uh, training opportunities and uh, digital tools to help with our our training uh, efforts. The other thing that's wonderful about our program is just the, the uh, nature of the facilities that are all located on one campus. It's quite unusual to find a, a VA hospital, a children's hospital uh, that's a tertiary center as well as a tertiary adult center and a cancer center all within such uh, close proximity of one another uh, on the same uh, campus. And so uh, really everything's here uh, for a training that's, that's needed. Uh, and the laboratory is really the core that, that ties all of these things together. The richness of these uh, tertiary referral samples is ideal for training. Uh, there's enough variety and enough of uh, the unusual uh, that we really can say that we, we sort of live in the zoo and uh, you better think more than footsteps when, you're, when you hear hoofbeats uh, around here because it's, it's very likely to be uh, a one-of-a-kind uh, sort of case. So I think that uh, diversity of uh, patients that come to the campus uh, for all disciplines uh, really uh, greatly enriches the, the program. Uh, my name is Wen Yi Luo. I'm a junior faculty member here at the Department of Pathology. And I did my uh, combined anatomic pathology and clinical pathology training uh, here at uh, uh, OU. Uh, I will summarize the training as comprehensive and uh, balanced. There is a very good balance between uh, neoplastic versus non-neoplastic disease, and there's also a very good balance between uh, anatomical pathology and uh, clinical pathology experience. My name is uh, Dr. Chelsea Deal. I'm one of the staff hematopathologists here at OU. Uh, I was actually a previous trainee. I was a previous resident. And then I went and did a hematopathology fellowship and came back as faculty a year ago. We have a lot of cancer patients here. We have a lot of complex care patients here. And so it really provides us a unique perspective um, to study some really complex patients. So one of the other aspects that I really loved about OU was the strength of our lab management training. Lab management training really isn't uh, emphasized all over the country in the way that it is here at OU. When you start day one as an attending, as scary as it is, you feel that you're prepared. I chose OU because during my interview, everyone was very friendly and collegial. I was asked during my interview what my interests were, what I wanted to do, and then gave me examples of how they could further my goals in my career. And that happened in my interview very quickly. I chose OU because it's the largest academic center here in the state. And I found a balanced program between the anatomic and clinical pathology. 
I choose OU because it has a really friendly environment for learning and also for professional development. OU is a no-brainer for me because it's a big family. Everyone here is just so friendly. My favorite thing about the program is the people here. The faculty are very approachable. The residents are easy to get along with. The good thing about this program is our faculty. They are very concerned about teaching and education and they encourage us to read more about our cases. One of the great things about our program is that everybody gets along well together. All the faculty are very helpful. Um, whenever I have a question, I don't feel intimidated to go talk to a faculty member. In addition to having an NCI-designated cancer center and a wide variety of specimens, we also have wonderful clinical pathology training. We have a wide array of ancillary testing that we do on campus in our molecular lab, as well as flow cytometry um, in-house. I had a unique opportunity during the pandemic to actually work on the COVID PCR testing for Oklahoma State. And this is one of the big collaborative project between Oklahoma Medical Research Foundation, OU Health Science Center, and also the OU Medicine. So I got to validate the assays, but also to program a LIMS for the laboratory, which is still being used today. This is one of the unique opportunities I don't think any other program will offer their resident to be involved in. Oklahoma City is a great place to live. There's a low cost of living. There's a lot of housing available near the medical center. You also have the amenities of living in a big city. There are lots of things to do. Being a recently founded city, Oklahoma has a lot of history and culture. We have a lot of outdoor activities nearby the city. So it's a really complete and friendly city for all the people who wants to visit. Several things that I like to do around Oklahoma is go to different sporting events. We have the OKC Thunder as well as the OU College football team. There's also various festivals to go to like the Greek, Czech, Turkish festivals around town. There's the Wichita Mountains that you can go hike at. They have bison, groundhogs, um, waterfall, hiking trails. It's really easy to live in Oklahoma on a resident salary. So if you want it, we have it. You just gotta be willing to go and find it. We just have a very collegial program here. It's a place you can really learn and thrive. I think it's just a wonderful place to be, and we're really excited to have you. OU is a no-brainer. You should definitely come here. <laughs>